Islam net is establishing a masjid and a community center. Every person who prays in this masjid, every child that memorizes the Quran, you will inshallah share in that reward. Donate now guys and do not delay. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh brothers and sisters and dear friends. I don't know if you guys have heard the latest controversy since I'm a controversial person. No, it wasn't me slapping a woman. It was Dana White. Dana White was seen in a club drinking alcohol and we know the evils of alcohol it's the mother of all evils which leads to domestic abuse especially when England loses and in different places but Dana White got upset for whatever reason it may be well maybe because his wife or his girlfriend slapped him first now he got slapped first and then he said you know what let me slap her back now some people might say how can she slap but that's a different topic here the topic here at hand is what is that she slapped him now many people have lost their mind over this not that she slapped him, by the way. The fact that he slapped her back. Now, as you guys know, brothers and sisters, we condemn any kind of violence towards anybody. And unjustified, you know. If somebody's coming to attack you, that's a whole different story. But the problem is the following. If a man was to go to a woman and slap her face, there will be absolute out up uproar. Rightly so. But what we're failing to understand is that those who call for equality and that gender is you know a social construct or whatever it may be that a woman slaps a man and the man slapping her back so she's, he's been slapped and he's slapping her back and there's an uproar not that she slapped him but the fact that he slapped her back the point is here now before we carry on yes before we carry on because i can say you know what as a muslim man what our religion teaches us and whatever it may be that 100 percent if a woman was trying to slap me, I mean, the most I'm going to do is just hold her, you know, try to restrain her and just, you know, say, you know, look, I don't want to hurt you because, you know, if I was to touch you, you'd probably die. So I'm just going to try to restrain 100%. But it's the double standards and the hypocrisy. Now, we have this individual, which we're going to react to now, who, for some odd reason, believes in equal rights, but only if it comes to women. Let's see what he has to say. Defending Dana White's actions and saying that because he was slapped first, it's all good. All's fair. Okay, so what you saw there, brothers and sisters. Now, I, if, if I'm looking from a perspective, from an outside perspective, and I'm looking like this is the worldview that you follow, I would have to call those MMI fighters and say, you know what? Actually, from their worldview point of view, they're just trying to be, they don't want to be hypocrites. They don't have double standards. And they're just like, look, you know what? At the end of the day, if we believe gender is a social construct, a man hitting a woman or a, a woman hitting a man, they are both acting on violence. So what some of the MMA fighters are saying is, well, let's be consistent here. So I can say, okay, from their worldview, which I don't agree with, at least they're having some kind of consistency. But this man is not happy about it. Let's find out why. Equal rights. Excuse me, where I come from, you get slapped by a woman 10 times, you walk away. I'm sorry. Okay, and who the hell said you set the standards of where I come from? Um, where I come from, if you get slapped by a woman 10 times, you walk away. Yeah? Who sets these standards? And who sets the number 10? Why not five? Why not 20? What about if she turns or decides to pick up a, ba a baseball bat or let's say a knife or even a gun? What on what paradigm do we put a stop to and say, well, here you can't do that. Who decides that? You? So the question I'm asking very simply, who said that you can set the standard of where I come from? I don't give a damn where the hell you come from. I'm sorry if that if, if, if that to you feels like I don't believe in equal rights, then fine. Because to me, equal rights is... I 100% agree. Equal rights. Now we're talking. Let's see what he has to offer. Treating women fairly. Treating women like we want to be treated. Women get paid the same. Get the same opportunities. That's equal rights. Hold on a second. We, we, we started off good. So here you was talking about equal rights. And I thought, you know what? This man is going to be just. So let me get this right. To your standards, an equal right. No, not an equal right. You want an unequal right. So basically, you are acknowledging biologically anatomically, physically, spiritually, whatever you want to name it, yeah, that she's in a disadvantaged position, 100%. How is that equality that you are saying, I wouldn't want this woman to treat me the way I would like to treat you? Duh, hello, yes. Do you not understand the hypocrisy that you've just uttered? I would like to be treated the way you, uh, uh, how you treat me. But you are the same person that's saying that if she slaps you and where you're from, we don't know where you're from, by the way, yeah? Where you're from, if she slaps you 10 times, that you just walk away. I mean, is there anything else that needs to be said except that I am starting to believe that you're a simp? 
Now I'm starting to believe that you are a simp Because anybody in their right mind that's watching this will say Hold on a second, he's making contradictory statements This man is not making sense to me at all Yeah, and he keeps talking about where he's from Which we don't know where he's from And he's an outright simp Because if you want to be treated the same way Meaning, Dana White does not want to be slapped He has a right to that So then how is it that you're saying Yes, you have a right not to be slapped But when you do get slapped, you're not allowed to slap back Are you stupid? To me, it seems like you are so desperate to get a woman that you are saying things that you don't even acknowledge yourself. Because only a person who is desperate would say such thing is, is cognitive dissonance, right? Literally, bro, if you think about it, only a desperate man, I'll be honest, in Jahili, I had friends who were very desperate and they would say anything to get girls. And you remind me of them. In a nutshell, that's it. Is there anything else? Adam, please. Brothers and sisters, let's be just here. Okay, so basically, in a nutshell, you guys, Heard what he had to say Now the fact that Dana White is not defending his he's, he's come out Well guess what Maybe look at the Stock The shares Of UFC And see what's happened to it There's, Maybe that's the reason Why Dana White has come out For whatever re reason It may be Just because he came out And said Oh I don't uh, You know I should have not Etc You know Imagine a woman Who's being abused Yeah And comes and says No 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 You know He loves me He hits me Because he loves me would it be justified? Would we believe it? Or would we say, oh my God, she's been manipulated or she's, she's, he probably beat her up before she made the statement. Why the double standards? This is the point that we're trying to point near brothers and sisters. And like he said before, so what if a UFC fighter, a woman, Amanda Nunes, imagine Amanda Nunes comes to you and you said, where I'm from, if you give me 10 stab, well, she give you one stab, you'll die. Yeah? Okay. Are you going to say, oh, okay, let me be okay with it? No, she's physically stronger than you. She can slap you. She can cause you harm. She can kill you. So, why is there double standards? That's all we wanted to say, brothers and sisters. Do you agree? Disagree? Comment in the section below, inshallah. And send this to this individual, whoever he is, inshallah. Till next time, assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Islamnet is establishing a masjid and a community center. Every person who prays in this masjid, every child that memorizes the Quran, you will inshallah share in that reward. Donate now, guys, and do not delay.